enzyme that is the lyso uh, next uh, antibiotic that is the lysozyme so lysozyme is a <coughs> glycoside hydrolase that how how they uh, break the <coughs> peptidoglycan layer so they catalyze the hydrolysis of 1 4 beta linkage between n acetyl muramic acid and n acetyl glucosamine so here we will see this is the nam structure this is the nac structure and with the first carbon and with the fourth carbon this one and this is the beta oh so their linkage is beta 1 for glycosidic linkage and what lysozyme is done lysozyme break this linkage okay and ultimately nag and nam will be separated from each other and ultimately the peptidoglycan layer will be break as the peptidoglycan layer is uh, composed of nag and nam okay so in this way the lysozyme can break the bond or or break the peptidoglycan layer and one thing we have to remember that penicillin break the cell wall when the cell wall is in synthesis period because after synthesis after synthesis of the peptidoglycan layer or after after the synthesis of the peptidoglycan uh, cross linkage by the transpeptidase then penicillin have no work because penicillin have to bind with the transpeptidase and pro provide the uh, and pro inhibit the cross linking but if the cross linking have already done then we have add the penicillin then there is no <coughs> inhibition of the cell wall so penicillin work when the cell is in synthesis period but lysozyme will work after the cell wall is synthesized when the cell wall is synthesized then penis uh, lysozyme came and break the bond or linkage between the nag and nam that is break the beta 1 for linkage okay so in this way lysozyme will work